Hello friends and welcome back to Testimony Tuesday. Today I want to share a story with you that happened actually back in March and we were going to share it with you but then we decided to wait. So here's what happened. We were in Nakhon Suwan and if you were following us back then then you'll know that you know you will see those videos. Um, but we were in Nakhon Suwan filming and praying for missionaries to come here and it it got more and more and more like maybe we are part of the answer to that prayer. It seemed like God was laying a burden on our hearts to come here. So we weren't sure, we hadn't decided or anything, but we thought, well, we should, uh, you know, since we're here, if we're going to move here, we should look around and uh, see if we can, you know, find a nice area that maybe has some houses for rent. So I looked on Google Maps and found, you know, a couple of places I wanted to go and look at. And so we came and we looked and we're driving around and uh, saw a house. Oh, you know, that looks like it might be empty. And then we saw another house. Oh, that looks, that looks like it's empty too. Wonder if we can find out, you know, how much they're charging for rent or if they're available or if they want to rent or whatever. So we didn't have time that day, so we came back the next day, and uh, it was about lunchtime, and we you know, tried to talk to the neighbors, but they didn't hear us or weren't home, and so we kind of parked at where that little road comes out to the main road, and we were, you know, preparing to eat our lunch, and I was cutting up a mango, and and um, then we prayed for the food, and I prayed very specifically. I said, Lord, if you want us to meet someone who can give us information about that house or help us, please just connect us. And I opened my eyes and I saw a truck coming down the road, the little road where the houses were. And oh, there's a truck coming. So Hannah went running out there. She speaks Thai better than me, which is why she was the one going. Uh, she went out there and started talking to them and they like left the truck parked in the road and came over to where we were and I uh, was talking with us, he, the guy started making phone calls. There were two guys and the one guy said about the man who was making the phone calls, yeah you guys are really lucky because he's the Gamnan, which means that he is over nine village headmen in this area. And so we were like, wow, what a guy to be, you know, in contact with. Um, and so that was just a very, very clear, direct answer to prayer. I prayed, opened my eyes, and the answer was driving up. And that was just a really, really amazing experience. Even though it didn't pan out to be what we thought it would be, um, it was something that God used to push us in the direction that He wanted us to move. So, hope that's a blessing to you. God bless. We'll see you next week.